But ripping on Joel Osteen, I know he's a great public speaker, but at least he loves the Savior and wants people to become like him. And at least instead of spending his entire ministry getting up and ripping on the LDS church or the Catholic church or whatever church it is that you spend your days ripping on. An hour a week. You do not emulate what to me is a Christ-like true Christian. And I know some really great Christians. Oh, I, I bet you do. not spend their time. Okay, Mary, you made the point. Let me tell you something. I don't give a rat's rear end what you think. Okay? This is what I care about. Truth. I care about truth. And Jesus, wait, 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 I let you talk, uh, wait, I let you, t I let you talk, Mary, 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 I knew I was going to do any good. Mary, I let you talk. You're an evil person, and I feel sorry for Mary, Mary Margarita and all why, your children. Wait, wait, Mary, why are you ripping on me? Why are you screaming at me? Let me talk. Oh, I, you started screaming when I was let me, No, I let you finish. <laughs> Let me talk. Mary, let, Mary, you, you made some propositions here. Let me speak. I don't care what your opinion is of what Christianity is or isn't. We have facts. When someone d dilutes the facts or changes them, I am going to stand up and say, why are you interrupting me? Why are you interrupting me? Trying to be like Christ. But ripping on the prophet of the Mormon church and the person running for the president of the United States, they so what? Is evil. The, You're an evil person. What are you talking about? Let me. If Jesus was here, he would rip on Monson too, and he would no, say, he "Don't vote for a Mormon." And he loved them. And he. You know what? You're just deluded. You, no matter you what care, he did. What are you? He's a really good person, and you've become evil. He's a really good and person, and I am not a person for speaking truth. You have truth. about you and all your black clothing. All my black. Ma Mary, did you hang up now? No, okay. I didn't. I'm still okay, here. Okay, just let me speak here, just for a second, without you interrupting. What is truth, Mary? Truth is trying to become like the Savior and live on a your, life like He did. On your own, wait, Mary. Okay, I just want a simple on your own terms. On your own terms, it's becoming like Him, and we try to read how it do you in become, the Bible. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. How do you, you know how, who He is and pray to Him? How do you become and, like Him, Mary? How do you become like Him? Explain that to me. How do you become like Him? Yeah. You pray to him and you develop a personal relationship with him. Okay, but that doesn't mean I gotta stop you. Are you LDS? On others. Are, are you, you as a person become have a relationship with the Savior? How does that happen? And then you share that with others by okay. teaching them love and okay. Christ. Like you don't. Okay, you stop, don't have stop. That okay, at all. you okay. have an evil spirit about you. Okay, I have the evil spirit. Then I put this to the channel. Oh, please, spirit please, King, Mary, and please. I can see it. Can I follow? You can see it. Okay, Mary, are you LDS? Yes, I am. Okay, you know very well you don't pray to Christ, so why are you saying that here? Because you pray in the name of Christ, and you name, know that, God, and you know. Okay, I know, I know. That's why I'm calling you out on it. You don't pray to Christ. Oh, Christians do. Yes. Christians do. Mormons you do know not. That I know. And spending time ripping on the other Mary, Mary, okay, you made your point. Isn't about being Mary, Christian. and I know a rare, uh, really, really, I know, really I know. Mary, Christian let's leader. talk about Christian facts, Mary. Baptist Mary, Mary you know Christians and Baptists. And Mary, let's talk about facts, okay? You say that you you become a you get in a relationship with Jesus Christ. How does that happen, Mary? How does that happen through reading your scriptures and daily prayer? That's how you establish a relationship with Christ. Mary, have you been born again? Yes, I have. How did that happen? How does happen being born again, accepting the Savior into your life? And who's and the, and who's like the Savior? I'm sorry? And who is the Savior? You're Mormon. Tell us who the Savior is. Who is the Savior? Yeah. Who is he? he he's Jesus Christ who died for us. You know that. He, uh, don't, don't add, I know that. Okay? Because you, we're having a dialogue here. Let's just let's just tone it down. So you say he's is he God? He is God. Yes. He is God. Okay. Do you worship him? Yes, I do. Was he created? Yes, he was. He, by whom? Who was he created? Who was he created by, Mary? Yes, he was created by our heavenly Father. Okay, with who? I'm sorry? Where did his spirit come from, Mary? It's always existed. Okay, but where did it come from? Because he's our brother, right? So where did okay. Jesus' spirit come from, Mary? 
It has always existed. No, that, it's, it's always existed in what way? Matter that, matter that has always existed. Matter has always existed according to Joseph Smith. Was Jesus a created being in his person like Lucifer and like you? His spirit? Yeah, his spirit that came down and took on this body. Was that formed and created by the Father? The spirit, was the spirit already existed? I know the spirit matter existed, but was the spirit matter formed into the spirit of Christ being a great and noble one prior, quoting the book of Abraham, like yours was and mine was, and Abraham and every inhabitant of the earth, was Jesus created it by, in his spirit by the Father in the preexistence? He was created just like us. He's okay, thank you. Now, let me ask you something. If he was created, how did he create all things? He created them with through the heaven, through Heavenly Father. But wait, Scripture says in John 1, He, Jesus, created all things. All. Okay? And the Greek is emphatic that it's all things. How did Jesus create all things? And the reason I point this out, Mary, is because you say, wait, you say, I want to have a relationship. You get that by reading the Scripture, which includes Bible, Book of Mormon, Doctrine and Covenants, Pro the Great Price. And you pray to Him, but I want to know who you're praying to, you see, because the Christians, Mary, believe Jesus is God uncreated no beginning alpha and omega no end and he created all things do you believe that as a latter-day saint true, true true christians do believe in the father and the son and the holy ghost i'm not saying there wasn't a father and son and holy ghost i want to know about christ to you mary you are if you if you're speaking truthfully as a latter-day saint jesus was created in his spirit just like you and i were he is our elder brother spiritually he offered to come down for us this is so contrary to how Bible believing Christians believe Mary exactly it is contrary to how it they is believe. contrary and so now on that it premise see, it doesn't no. say that I'm not Christian because it's contrary to how they believe because we we differ on some things some things take away that an LDS person is Christian okay Mary Mary let's just talk about God though his father our father in heaven where did he come from Mary he has always existed where did he come from was he ever a man, Mary? Okay, you're getting way too deep into this. No, I'm just that asking you. Was, was he a man, Mary? He, he may have existed as a man. Okay, so now we have <laughs> no, another fundamental difference. No, 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 no. We have another fundamental difference. The God we worship is not a man. He's never been a man. He does not have a penis. He does not copulate with Mary in creating Jesus in a body of flesh. So you call here and you spin this screaming yarn, which I'm returning to you now, and you act like, oh, we're so Christian and you're so not, and you have an evil spirit and, and we're the same. And then when we just ask about five questions, you fail on every one of them. Every single one of them you fail based on what the Bible says. And you call here, and you get on my case, and you say, I have an evil spirit. You are deceived. This is the reason we do it, Mary. Because everything you believe, everything, is a falsehood relative to biblical Christianity. I feel sorry for you. I don't for care what you feel you. about me. It's irrelevant what you feel. What are the facts, Mary? What are the facts? Research your prophet Joseph Smith's life. Research the doctrines you say you believe in. Go to your temple and swear oaths. If you'd like to make a call, please You gotta understand, when they're screaming, I scream back, it is part of the entertainment. I could sit with Mary right now, have a Diet Coke, eat fries, and talk normally. But when we're in this debate, they call because they have a voice, and they think they can show everybody listening how smart they are and how good Mormonism is. And it's a lie, it's part of the fraud. So you gotta hit them right where they're, right where they're at so that you can show them you are not telling the truth. I wish Joel Osteen, would, did you notice that she brought up my criticism of Joel Osteen? You know, but before I bowed, she never even mentioned Joel Osteen, but he sided with the Mormons. I wish Joel Osteen would say, Mitt Romney says he believes in Jesus is the Son of God. Why doesn't Joel Osteen say, Mitt, who is, the, who is Jesus? Why doesn't he say, who is God? Why doesn't he say, what do you think of the... Uh, we could talk about how they say Jesus was a created being. Bible says he's the Alpha and the Omega. Uh, Bible says he was not created by anybody. He's uncreated. M Mormons say he was a created being. Mormons say he is our spiritual brother. He's a spiritual brother to Lucifer. The Bible says, no, 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 no. Lucifer is a fallen angel. Jesus created all...
all things, including the angels, including Lucifer. More the way it goes, my friend. Well, speak more yeah. slowly and clearly. It's okay. Like I said, I've been a member for 15 years. Yeah. I like the rhetoric. I've been a member for the last 15 years of this faith. Okay. I grew up Irish Roman Catholic first and foremost. Okay. All of the stuff that you're spewing out about the church, I've heard about religions for years. Okay, you've heard yeah, it I, all. What does that mean? What are you trying to say? I don't like the way you're talking about faith. I don't care what you like or not. You know what I like? I like truth. No, no, no. I don't know. Yes, yes, yes. I don't like your guys standing up there and telling people I love lies so that they'll continue to try to figure out the bondage they're under to go to your temple. So don't call here and tell me you don't like how I talk about your faith. I'm giving you facts. You've heard them this whole time, and what have you done? This? You may be talking facts, Jack. I have given you facts. I've given you references. What do you want? Like I said, I've been kept. Okay, I can't. Is there something wrong? Is it me? Trash for Okay, you've got to slow down because it's not coming through. This is great. He has to I've heard slow and I more than you'll ever know. I grew up with the faith. I spent eight years of my life. Okay, all this is subjective experience. Give me um, something that's real. Any time I've heard their lies. Okay, I've, I, I, I. Give me something that's no, real. I go out. I go out. I don't care how you grew up. You Give that, me something that's you real. Trash the religion all you want to do. I, I'm not trashing the religion. I am pointing out turn facts. Your back on the faith because whatever whatever reason you turned your back on the faith twenty some odd years ago, pal, or thirty some odd years ago, it's your problem. You have the problems with that. I don't. Really? I, I enjoy. Being Fine, enjoy it. Enjoy being Enjoy it, dude. Life. I am not saying. Oh, I'm. Look, enjoy it and turn the channel. I am going to teach the truth. You can go back, put it on your you're blinders, put your the, fingers in your ears, and enjoy your truth, your little fiction. You know, there's people who go to Disneyland.